This is the season finale of season one. Grappling hook! I told you it would come in handy. Yes, yes. I think from episode one, they've been pushing the grappling hook. And you have just gone completely mental, but I don't blame you. Sock it to me. I don't blame you because this is like the most incredible cliffhanger for me. Uh, Grunkle Stan's got all three books. <laughs> ah! <laughs> He's got all three books. You can see the symbol that the uh, that Bill Cipher has seen before, and that's also on the flag. It's on the side. Uh, I, I never noticed that before. The so that symbol keeps popping up, um, which is our, which is funny because all the other stuff like I wrote down is just funny stuff. Like, hey, look, they had the Disney font for Gideon Land, and uh, uh, th I never knew what the eyepiece was in the book. Um, so that, you can read it easier? Uh, but but why just... Maybe, like, the person that did it has only one eye, or maybe it's even Bill Cipher. Or something. I don't know. It's interesting that it's just one eyepiece. Um, and uh, the only other thing I noticed is that the uh, the gnome cologne is just N-O-M, but a little unlauten on top of the O. Uh, <laughs> I thought that was pretty funny. Um, I just... Oh, three bucks! It, it, okay, you see what I mean? Because before, like... I literally, like... Grunkle Stan pulled out book number one, and that was literally my reaction. Doug laughed because I just went, ah! <laughs> No, that, that was pretty much my reaction when I first saw this one. I mean, everything, this is a great episode. I mean, this, this is just, oh, it was <laughs> epic. It, it, had it had fucking creepy ass Gideon. The little, yeah, it was. And remember to wear your buttons. It's my face. <laughs> it, 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 it was funny. It was Really big, it was really epic, it had some great action in it. Uh, really creative, the giant robotic Gideon kills me. Again, it's both just really kind of threatening and really funny. Mabel provides moral support, and though she just she does end up in Gideon's grasp, but even at the end, though, she saves the day. Grappling hook! Well, that, that's what I like about it. They both kind of end up saving each other. Kind of. Everybody kind of saves everybody uh, in the show. Which when is Zeus how I think mentioned it that be. he was a part time bus driver when he was in the restaurant and it showed Dipper in the bus, Dipper and Mabel in the bus with the gum that looked like the face of yeah. Abraham Lincoln. And, no, uh, Reagan, thank you. Oh, I'm sorry, Reagan, yeah, the face of Ronald Reagan um, and the Canadian coin. When they were being chased by the giant robot, I'm like, and he goes, bus driver, I'm like, please be Zeus, please be Zeus, please be Zeus. And then it was, and I was like, yay! Um, so this episode, Gideon takes over the Mystery Shack, they have to live with Zeus's uh, uh, grandma, and they're trying to find a way to get it back. At first it looks like they had to be sent home, which is one of those scenes where it's like, you know they're not gonna get sent home, you know they're not, but it's... It legitimately kind of works. I got I, sad. I'm kind of sad, yeah. That was legitimately sad, and the other thing that was sad was when he was abusing Waddles, and I was like, he's like, he blows the whistle, and the pig's like, and he's like, get back in that corner, and I was like, oh, oh no, oh, boo! You leave Waddles boo! alone! Nobody does that to Waddles. Um, and, yeah, so I, I thought, you know, it's one of the few times you see Stan, like, legitimately sad. Not kind of, like, ironic or just a hint. It's like he is actually really, really sad to see the kids go. Uh, and it works. It doesn't feel forced. It feels very, you know, you know it's well, that scene we see in a lot of kid shows where it's like they're going, oh, no, they're going to be gone, even I though you know they're not. I feel bad, like, but... I love it when Stan's initially lying. He's like, don't worry, your son and daughter are fine. Yeah. yeah, no, if I really felt I couldn't take care of them, I would send them home. So, like... I felt that even though he's a liar and you could read that as always just lying to cover himself, I really felt like he wanted to be able to take care of them and felt really bad that he couldn't. Yeah. Which is why eventually he decides to send them home. But at first he's like, I can do this! Well, which makes it even sadder when he does send them off because you know he really doesn't want to. You know, he yeah. really wants them to stick and around. that's sweet. Uh, yeah, and the, uh, the action scene with the giant robotic Gideon I, I think is great. I love um, the frog suit he wears that he's able to steer it. It's like one yeah. of those Japanese mechas. Like. Well, it, it's got the dots on it, too, the motion capture yeah. and stuff. And when, um, when Dipper breaks through the eye and starts fighting him and the robot's like, Ish, ow, ow, ow. Yeah, I mean, that, that's great. It's I don't know. Like, this episode, like, I already love this show, but this episode in particular, I'm watching, I'm just like, this is kind of everything I want in a really funny, entertaining cartoon show. You know, it's like, it I, I, I like Avatar, everything. but Avatar, yeah, Avatar is a serious show with a lot of funny elements. This is a comedy with a lot of serious elements it had everything uh, and it was really epic on top of that yeah and it had the mystery like that's the one thing like a lot of the episodes we saw in this sort of 
round that we've done didn't have the mystery. With the exception like, of the one before with the yeah, Bill Cipher. Yeah. With the Bill Cipher. And like, yeah, after a while I was kind of like, well, they're very fun and entertaining, but I kind of missed the mystery. And now we got it back in a big way. Yeah, that uh, that ending, like I said, because I was saying before that's like, all right, I'm not going to watch any more episodes, Rob. I'm just going to finish off the season and I'll wait for season two. And then I saw that ending. I'm like, no, 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 I can't stop there. It's impossible for anyone to stop there. I went into season two. Oh, uh, plus, the gnomes are back. Yes, the gnomes came back. They're still hilarious. Oh, <laughs> uh, the squirrel bath. <laughs> no, I love the fact that's most likely not a gnome thing. That's just that Him. particular gnome's thing. <laughs> That's because he's trying to, uh, yeah, this is what gnomes do. I, I swear, this is what we do, Pat Pat. Hey, Doug. Shmabulak! <laughs> is that all you can say? Shmabulak. <laughs> well, yeah, I, what I love is that there's, like, a pause. Like, he's trying to think of something else to say, but he knows he can. Shmabulak. <laughs> the, the timing on this the, show is so the good. The gnomes came back. I, uh, what the hell else was I going to say? Ah, uh, I forget. They, as usual, though, the gnomes hover in that weird world of, like, funny and occasionally legitimately creepy. When they all gang up on you, I'm just like, yeah, they're kind of creepy. Like, when they're hauling them off, like, no! I like when they use other gnomes as, like, arrows yeah, and swords. Like... <laughs> uh, no, I love this oh, one. Oh, that's what I was going to say. When the gnomes have got Dipper and Mabel and... Uh, Gideon's out saying, now take him away! And the journal falls out, and he's like, you, you had it all along? And I'm just like, oh no, oh no, this is bad. Oh no, those two journals can't, this is gatekeeper keymaster shit. This guy, I'm like, no, 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 don't open it, oh god. But that's made even better by the fact that you realize it's not the one, it's not the one yeah. he's looking for. Uh, which makes it, you know, it's great that then he's chasing after them because there's still a mystery where it's the first one when he pulls it out at the end, and he has all three books, and you're just like, what is this? What's it going to be? What's it amounting to? Uh, You're under arrest for being a fraud and for breaking our hearts. <laughs> uh, I, I love it. I, I don't think I could have asked for like a better ending to a season one and a better cliffhanger. Um, it was so, great. Yeah, I, I, I love it. And honestly, as much as I love the first season, uh, I think the second season gets even funnier and has even more like creative no, and stuff. No, no, you lie. It, 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 it can't does. get better. This was so good. It does get better. I don't know. Too much awesome. Too much awesome. We may have to wait. No, I don't. We will not wait. We okay. Well, we will wait. But you will see it in the next video. More awesome <laughs> on the way. I don't know if I can handle it all. Hooray! I'm taking that sweater away from him. Never!